I was feeling really good. Things were going great. Uh, I'd been out with my mates. My mates and I have an indoor cricket team we played together. Uh, we, this year is our 20th year of playing in our indoor cricket team together, which is pretty awesome. Uh, but on this occasion, I'd got home. We'd played indoor cricket. We'd had the grand final. We'd won the grand final. I was like, yes, how good is today? Life is going great. I got home and uh, my wife was sitting on the end of the bed. And she says, Brett, we need to talk. You know, it was just that tone of voice. There was just something there that went, oh, no, this isn't one of those good conversations. She said, um, I can't keep doing this. I don't want to do this anymore. Um, and so from that space of time, um, three days later, she'd asked me to move out of our house. Um, within three weeks, I'd found my own house and, and was trying to adjust to um, a totally different life. Um, and so that kind of led me on this journey of self-discovery you know we're talking before about how sometimes these challenges uh, can be there for a reason and we'll sort of circle around back to why I think that reason might have been as we get towards the end of this talk but um, definitely for me it was a period of immense challenge um, and at the same time as a result of that it was a period of immense growth um, and one of the things that it really helped me to understand is the way our body works and the way our brain works um, and what I could do to help get myself from that point back to where I really wanted to be.